we were told at the age of four that I wouldn't I wouldn't live until nine. Right. Um, and we just continually proved doctors wrong. You know, you just push and push. Every day was a struggle, and every day was, you know, a blessing. When you were about to, like, go under for surgery for the transplant, what was the last thought you had? I was super excited. Um, I was scared, but I was really excited. Um, I wanted to, um, live, and I didn't want to die. And, um, I prayed for the family of the donor, um, to have them you know, just uh, find some peace. Can you describe for me what it was like when you heard your heart and lungs for the first time? One, my heart is in the right place. My heart was never in the right place before. So I actually uh, listened to my heart and lungs on the step-down unit for the first time, and it was really, really cool. Um, and they just sound so strong. And my other heart and lungs just sounded so um, sick. Unfortunately, I think that people have lost their lives because people don't recommend, trans, you know, getting transplant teams involved soon enough.